Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Royal Park Fine Wine, What's Hot Now? Um, we're still going through some really, really cool weather right now, as in warm weather, uh, which is well needed. So we've picked on two wines today and they happen to be both red wines that would complement this kind of weather based on the food that we eat this time of the year. Um, the first wine we picked on is a Cantina Zaccanini. It is a Montepulciano di Abruzzo. I love saying that word, Montepulciano di Abruzzo. So the name of the grape and the name of the area are the same. So the grape is Montepulciano and the area is Montepulciano di Abruzzo. Lovely, lovely wine. This is a wine that I love the presentation on it. I don't know if you can see it, but it has a little twig over here. That's a cutting from the vineyards that this wine comes from and it represents that that ties the wine to the actual vineyard beautiful presentation on it so Montepulciano is a is a is a product that there's a, a decent amount of it on the market but yet not a lot of people like to venture into things that are not familiar with so I would say this is the Bigger, bigger brother of a Pinot Noir and the younger brother of a Cabernet. It's right in between. Beautiful color, uh, great intense ruby color on it. This is a 2018, and it retails at $14.99, and it is based on the on the price range. It is just absolutely gorgeous wine. Um, I'm getting some dark. The color on it is just, it's gorgeous. Again, spice blackberry, mild spice blackberry. A little vanilla on the finish, that's from the oak barrels very pleasant nose not offensive in any way just very round lovely um, strawberry jam that big strawberry jam uh, flavor that nice spice again little vanilla on the finish of that one all I can say is this is a fun, fun, fun wine. It is so pleasant, so easy to drink. It's not what you think of when you're going to Italian wines. Some Italian wines, they can get little, um, they can talk back, they can get a little pungent, they can get a little bit edgy, but this is such a great round wine. Uh, your pizza, Wednesday, pizza night, uh, pasta night, um, I, I, I was in uh, Montepulciano a few years ago and uh, one of the wineries we went to, they actually served it with a slight chill on it and it gave it such a great flavor, which in general is a no-no, but with this one, it worked absolutely perfect. I, again, uh, Cantina Zaccanini, Montepulciano di Abruzzo, 2018, $14.99. Phenomenal value, you gotta try it. Uh, next wine happens to be my top best-selling wine in the store. It is Bone Shaker Zinfandel. It's a 2019 Lodi at $18.99 a bottle. I love this wine. We sell lots and lots and lots and lots of this wine. It's something that we order every single week. We got a lot of people on this wine and that's one of the reasons I wanted to share with you. Um, it is from the Lodi area, Lodi area out of California. Uh, you know, it's, it's a warmer area, so it produces some of the plummier, juicier kind of uh, grapes, which Zinfandel grows best in Lodi and Paso Robo, but Lodi also. Lodi, uh, Lodi is also the birthplace to A&W root beer. Oh, aromatic, intense, sweet cherries. Mm, plummy, 
that nice ripened plum, little vanilla also. I got that on the other wine also. Mm. Polished flavors of cranberry, ripened strawberries, plum again. I'm getting a little bit of a little uh, black pepper on the finish in a, in a very pleasant way. I love this wine. Um, this is a must try. Food wise, barbecue, barbecue, barbecue. Anything plummy, uh, red sauce, uh, pasta sauce, uh, spaghetti sauce, make your own barbecue sauce, uh, chicken, grilled chicken with barbecue sauce. This is the wine to have with barbecue. Uh, again, love, love, love this wine. Bone Shakers Infidel 2019 Lodi, 1899 a bottle. That's it for today. Thank you so much. Enjoy your day and God bless.